Joshua 3, 11. Hine, Aaron Habarit, Adon Kol Haaretz, Over Livnechem Biarden. Joshua continues his speech to the people, and he says, Behold, the Ark of the Covenant of the Lord of all the earth, crossing over before you in the Jordan. The verb here, over, this comes from ayin, bait, resh, and it's a kal, participle, masculine, singular, uh, crossing over. So it's just taken in the very general sense, probably with a gerund ending, ing. And then we can see that there's Ark of the Covenant, so a construct phrase, and another one, the Lord of all the earth, construct phrase, and Lifnechem Bayardain. We have before you in the Jordan. So we have these three phrases then, the Ark of the Covenant of the Lord of all the earth going before you in the Jordan. So in this case then, this is Joshua continuing his speech to the people, and he begins with Hine. And Hine is a point of view word. And so he is very consciously uh, drawing the people's attention to the Ark of the Covenant going before them into the Jordan. That is, he's trying to direct their attention there. Because what he's been talking about in the previous verse, he's continuing. That they can have confidence that the Lord God is with them. So this whole chapter so far has been uh, emphasizing a self-conscious attention to the authority of the Word of God. A self-conscious attention to the presence of God. And now he wants the people to behold the God who's going to be with them. Uh, his ark will go before them across the Jordan River.